Open Book 9.0. So here we are going to looking at the laptop screen. After we have pressed the space bar, we get this image on the laptop. Now bear in mind this is really going to be suitable for either people with low vision or people who are totally blind, but these features I'm going to concentrate on now are more about the low vision aspect. So in the top part of the open book screen we can see a large print version in a particular colour scheme, um, which is a single column of the scanned document. In the lower part of the screen we can see the original image, it's just a static photograph, but it shows the exact layout of the original document. So we have synchronised cursors here. So if I press my right arrow on the computer, and orange, we have the two cursors. And we have the cursors in the large print view and the cursors moving through the actual uh, facsimile down below. Serves for as a side dish. So, for example, we might be using the top part of the screen just for listening fluently um, and we might be using the lower part to, if there were diagrams or charts or annotations in a textbook, we could then zoom in on those particular parts visually but be listening to the surrounding text orally. So this is a particularly powerful combination. It's portable, of course, it's a laptop with a very lightweight pearl scanner. And in addition to that, we have all of these sorts of uh, features that you might use in a computer, like, for example, Control F. So Control F is just the find text the dialogue, find text find dialogue box. box. So if I'm looking for the word um, dried, D -R -I -E -D, found, dried. So we instantly find go next. there, and that might be repeated multiple times. We could find the next, the next uh, dried, and so on. Now, imagine you'd scanned twenty-four pages, and you were looking for a particular case point or diagram three, or uh, some sort of uh, anatomical term. You can very quickly navigate straight away to that point. If you compare that to what you would do with a clear reader, as a standalone reader without a screen, with no find feature. Uh, you'd have to listen from top to bottom until you heard that word. Clearly not as convenient, especially not for a student. So this is the open book with Perl. The Perl camera will also work with JAWS and Zoom Text Fusion um, and highly portable and uh, a very effective solution for students.